Welcome back to Metro Exodus. In the last episode, we went to that big ship in the valley over where I'm pointing. I wish I could actually point the mouse pointer on the map, but over there, found a bunch of slaves and dealt with the thugs that were up in the ship. Now oh, I've headed over here next to this weird, gaseous, horrible swamp place and found this little area that seemed kind of hidden away. Like a, something weird happening on the face there, like carved out holes. Looks like people might be living in there or something. Let's go check it out. Obviously the slavers have been here. Yep. Locked? Does that imply I can maybe drive this at some point? They might be talking, I'm not sure who they're talking about, maybe the person whose name I forgot, who's part of a, like, Canyon Freedom something? People trying to lead all these slaves to freedom? Free everybody? Get these slugs to fuck off? They might be talking about them. By the way, I hope beeping on my motion detector doesn't make noise others can hear. <laughs> I really, really hope. Hey! Что это? Подозрительно. Was it fast enough? I'm not sure if they sort of spotted me or if they heard the beeping. I think that worked out better. Yeah, so I don't think they do hear the beep. I think they just kind of spotted me because, you know, it's daylight. Oh. Wait, I can cut that. Am I going to take it? What is it? It's beautiful. Oh, I took some a beautiful wind chime and turned it into one materials. That's sad. I'd rather just leave it as it was. Let's try to get some height. Oh, they're not talking to me. Good. Two thugs disagreeing about something? What the hell am I hearing? Oh, 
Oh, dogs? Oh, no. Oh! They can see me. They can't do anything about it, though. Right? Surely there's no way up here. Oh my god! How? How? Okay, maybe rather than going down there, let's go further up. Oh, maybe we can. Yes, we can. I don't know where the person is who's yelling. They sound like they're right down there somewhere. But I see nothing but bodies. God, this game's so pretty. Where does this go? Oh. Hey, buddy. Another one of these. Um, hmm, I don't think I can sneak past this one. Do I have to kill it? I don't want to kill it. Can I do something janky and, like, get over there in that little spot, that little corner? <laughs> got it! I got it! We're good! Yep. Totally worth it. Oh, that must be the person who's talking. I don't know where they were before. Anyway, uh, I might just avoid that entire area. Let's just go here. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if this really helps anything. This looked like a pathway to me. But it's not. No, okay. <laughs> I really should sleep. <laughs> but there's nowhere really that close. So I'm gonna go with it. How do I knock these people out? Actually, hold on, are you even an enemy? They might not be an enemy. I think they're not. They're red, they're not. Yeah, these might be the Freedom Fighters? Damn it, they saw me. Well, kinda. They... They didn't totally see me. They're not fully activated. We'll just throw a distraction over there. That didn't seem to work for this person. Go out. Go check it, huh? Go check it out. 
Вот он! I think I just gotta shoot him. <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry, dogs. Where did these people come from? Oh. Well, hmm. Okay, I'm gonna take a different tactic entirely. Let's knife the dogs. Sorry to do it, but I think I pretty much have to. Hmm. I don't want to knife that dog when it's right next to that person. And I think the dogs just smell you if you get near. Yeah, if you get spotted, you hear that honking. I think that's the other ones coming. Man, this is so hard to do during the daytime. Okay, finally. Man, that was really hard to get those both without alerting anybody else. Oh. Oh, it's actually just a light I can turn on and off. That's cool. It's the first time I've seen that. I don't even want to use a tin can because it seems like that gets their attention enough that they may be calling reinforcements. So I don't want to get their attention at all. See? Yeah, like, I did that. And I just saw that person up there go running away. progress. Trying to stealth kill people without getting even the slightest bit of alarm in the broad daylight. Not the best idea. Ah, oh, they're coming over here. I guess I sort of got their attention. Come over here. The wind must have blown that out. Hey, buddy, shh. Hey, I see that full skull. Talk at the statue of Pot Vanas, but it's I just did. I was the other people come regardless. Okay, well, we need to shoot them then. I'm sorry, puppies. Here's someone else. Where are you at? I definitely heard somebody else's voice. 
Стой! Все равно ничего больше не под... Не будет же он безоружного убивать. Не бандит а. все-таки. Hello. Is that an entirely new type of weapon? What is that? Let's replace my shotgun. Uh, let's look at what this thing's called. Bulldog, yeah, that's a new type of shotgun? Right? It's gotta be. Looks really cool. Um, turpin stocks, let's put the semi-grip, it's the best. Short barrel, suppressor. I can try to suppress, I now have a shotgun that I can suppress. Hmm. Of course it's with mixed results, just like the assault rifle one. That increases the damage, lower stability. Well, damage is more important, I think, than stability. Especially for a shotgun. That looks beautiful, the way the wood... Well, the way the wood just looks. <laughs> it's very pretty. Iron sights. Reflex or night vision. Reflex. Small magazine. No gadgets. Okay. Yeah, this thing is a shotgun, right? Wait. It's not? Shit, it's an assault rifle. Also, I didn't install any of those things because I didn't double-click them. These are damn good iron sights. Those little dots. There we go. Yeah, so I wonder how this compares to the Kalosh. They both use the same type of ammo. I mean, well actually, let's just look how they compare now. Like, how do they compare in damage and whatnot right now? I know they don't have the same attachments, but just like roughly, is there any big differences? Kalosh has quite a bit more damage. Quite a bit more accuracy. Wait. No, I was looking at them in reverse. The Bulldog has quite a bit more damage. Quite a bit more accuracy. Significantly less stability and rate of fire and magazine. Yeah, I don't view rate of fire and magazine as... Well, rate magazine is important. But I don't view rate of fire and stability as super important as long as they're decent. And they are in either one. So I value much more that huge increased accuracy and decent increase to damage. Yeah, this would be pretty damn good as a as a sniper, actually. Of course, I do have the thing that's actually literally a sniper, which would probably even better. But damn, this this thing's good. This thing's real good. Yeah, let's use the bulldog as my saw rifle now, and I'll actually replace the Kalosh with a shotgun. No, oh, it's starting to become nighttime, I think. I hear crickets. They're true to the word. Put down a rope ladder. Say hi. What the hell? The fuck was that? Did you just shoot yourself? Was that the person that... That was the person that helped me up here. Why? Death Note. You saved me and I thank you for that, but I, but I am a dead man already. I have nothing to live for left, for I lead my people to death. They all believed we could win. I decided to start the fight. 
not endure any more. Was I not right? But now everyone is dead. It was I who lost, not them. But it was they who died, not me. And this is also my fault, my shame. And this shame I cannot live with any more. I must join my people now. Arsene. Arsene. Was that the freedom fighter? Leader? Yes, with this letter I, Arsene Mustafa, declare to you a lowlife calling myself the Baron. Yeah, yeah, that was the leader of the, um... What were these people? The free people of the free canyon. I guess I kind of got here a little bit too late, huh? To this whole place. They already lost, it sounds like. Sorry, buddy. Ooh. Wait a second. What's beeping? This way? What the hell? The dots don't make any sense. I move closer to it and then it shows up in a completely different area. Like, look, it's over this way. Okay. Now it's all... What? Maybe it's like right above me or something. I don't know. It's not you. I mean, obviously you're not moving and the dot's not on you either. That is really weird. Okay, what is this? Armored glass. This visor design makes the mask much more resistant to damage, rendering it a lot harder to crack. Hmm. Okay, so the base one is just the base one. Extended filter does exactly what it says. Reinforced helmet is just like the base one, but with more actual literal armor. In the sense that you'll, like, take less damage. This armored one doesn't actually give you more armor, ironically. It has the same armor and stats as the base one. But it's just harder to crack, so you don't need to repair it as often. I'm still gonna go with the extended filter. Because filters are expensive. They don't last very long. I'm wondering if I want this motion scanner still. Is the beeping kind of annoying? I mean, I know it kind of is right now, but... Hmm... It's, it's, kind, it's pretty handy. I'm gonna keep it for now. Right, uh, for the bulldog... Let's go ahead and give it a red, la red laser. And now we can give it a standard magazine. Probably because we stopped using our main assault rifle. And let's give it a night vision scope. It is dark now, and I'm going to keep it that way. It's not the same as the 4X scope, but it does zoom in a bit. Because this thing is damn accurate. Like, it's incredibly accurate. Yeah, that's good. Should I give it a suppressor? It hurts the damage a lot, but it barely hurts the accuracy. And if you hit them in the head, like, I don't think it matters how much damage it does. I think they're just dead. Hmm. Yeah, okay, I'll try the suppressor. Let's make some things. A couple med kits. Maybe three, actually. Doesn't hurt to have more. I have tons of ammunition for pretty much everything except the shotgun, but I don't need tons for that. Uh, I'll make one more. That's fine. Uh, I'll make ten more of that. I'll make another can. One Molotov. Oh, I didn't look at the cost. That was damn expensive. Well, I could dismantle it for six of chemicals back when I spent 40 on it. <laughs> that's a bad return. Okay, that's good. I'm curious what the Bulldog Night Vision Scope looks like when it's actually at night. 
This thing looks absurd, by the way. Jesus, it's so bulky. Ooh. Man. It's hard to see. I don't really like it. But it is not fully dark yet. That's probably the problem. And I do have the, the red laser, right? That laser's pretty good for short distances, so it's not like it's unusable even if I can't really see through the scope. Oh yeah, it sounded like they drove up in a car and sure enough, there it is. Don't suppose this one uses the same key? Just rabbits. That is so cool. <laughs> nope, doesn't use the same key. Do rabbits show up on motion detectors? Answer is no, which is good. That'll cut down on a lot of false alarms. Right. Where to next? Let's go to that question mark this way. You know, is there anything out here? Like... Like, maybe that vehicle out there, maybe there's something there in that fetid pit of who the hell knows what. Should I run out there to see? You know what? What the hell? I'm gonna assume I need my mask. I don't actually know. Let's freaking go. Oh, it's not nearly as bad as I thought. There's actually walkable surfaces. I thought it was all goo. Uh. Yeah, it turns out there's really not much out here, huh? Oh, hi. Bye. enough that I'm considered in the light, according to my sensor. Whoops. Just the question mark, right? Yeah, pretty much. Why is there just a random campfire? Somebody there? I don't see them. around back of him and throw some knives back there. Whoa, that's an ATV. Is so cool. <laughs> it's 
So where exactly is the question mark? Just like this boat? This little boat area? really anything here. Oh, I did not mean to turn on that light. That is pretty badass. Just circling around a group of these zombie things and just throwing knives at them and collecting them while being chased by said zombie things. I got all my knives back too. Sweet. Yeah, I can't ride any of these things because I don't have any keys for them. That's the same symbol that was next to the uh, Freedom Fighter person. Is this one of their little caches, outposts? What's going on over there? How did that boat get there? Did the water come up this high? Because I know this all used to be water. I don't think there's any people here. This is actually pretty extensive. No, I think it's just full of monsters. Come on, our team. Okay, I can take a hint. Can't go there. Wow, what a cool little place. So many different levels to it. Just hit me through the boat. Damn it, I think I need to shoot. All right, fine. Oh, I forgot this thing had a suppressor. That's fine then. I was worried about waking up the whole valley. Heh. 
I'm missing a knife. Ah. <laughs> that does not look like a safe bridge. Oh my god! Now that is some ingenuity. down there safely. <laughs> yeah, that's not it. Safest way I can think of to get to the other side is just to do this. Yeah, I don't know how you're supposed to get there safely. Because there's definitely stuff here, right? Like symbols and like people have been here. I just don't know what the path is supposed to be. I'm gonna go without night vision because I like how everything looks better without it. The explosive awakening, wasn't it? I think I can crawl in there. Three of my knives are up there. How accurate am I while jumping? Come on, Art Jim, you're getting a good boost there. All right, we can probably... Oh, Jesus Christ. Deep sleeper. I'm guessing I can probably get back there by going in here. Oh, no. In that case, is there any way up there? Probably, right? It looks like a whole thing. Just three of my knives are up there. A truck fell down there. I see you. Oh, right above him. I'm not going to take these apart, actually. They're really pretty. Ah! Ah! 
Jesus Christ. All these fires, this place is starting to look pretty homey, you know? Nice and cozy. No, actually, it's creepy as fuck. <laughs> so, two ways to go. It's like a little thing I can squeeze through. That's pointless. Can I, can I not continue there? There's a bunch of stuff in there. There's a lot of stuff in there. Did they build like a whole complex inside of this canyon, mountain, face thing? Looks like there's a whole mountain thing. Like, there's like an entrance up there. And there's like la a ladder going up there. I'm definitely missing like a way to go. Yeah, there's that up there. It looks pretty broken. But how do I get there? Can I like myself up onto that tarp maybe it's just ornamental like maybe it's just to be looked at to make it look like a real place but maybe you're really not supposed to go there maybe I'm gonna look around wait no 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 I found it yep tracing it back that goes down there I need to go up here Letter to the artist. Dear, Nadir, this baron is taking us for fools. Have you read the leaflet his flunkies heaped at all the entrances? You call yourself free people, but your leader superiors and in fact owners crammed you all into caves and would have their stones fall on your heads rather than let you receive the blessing of the holy flame. He's ripping the revelation off and thinks we're none the wiser. Do you remember asking me what, what's an artist to do after the doomsday? I couldn't give you any, any advice back then, but now I have an idea. Paint our reply to this dog. Paint it so everyone could see what was, what is yet to be, and why we will never surrender. Paint to make souls sing. I know you can. Always your friend, Arsene. Oh! That's so cool! We can unroll a shortcut. Actually, wait. This didn't lead where I thought it would? I thought this kept going. The only thing I can think of to do is I think I could make this jump from here to there. Because I want my damn knives back. I might die, though. <laughs> Oof. Anything else I can think of is let's check down here. This one's like caked over. That is black. Yeah. 
Yeah, there's nothing down here. Okay, I think we're done. I just gotta find my way out of here. Oh. It's easier than I thought. Can probably get back by jumping up here. And we're back. That was a really interesting place. Alright, well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. Looks like it's... Oh, I thought it was almost morning, but it's only like 1 in the morning. Sky is awfully bright. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return... I think I might head to the lighthouse. <laughs>